KMIR Sports from the Legal Docs by Me Sports Desk. The Harlem Ambassadors put on quite the show at Shadow Hills High School's volleyball fundraiser. The pros took down the Nightmares 130 to 113. High score, right? Well, the Nightmares were given 10 points for every three-pointer made. Now, also, you might be thinking of the Harlem Globetrotters, but there's a big difference between the two teams. For the Ambassadors, it's always about getting the community together for a good cause. What differentiates us from the other Harlem teams, a lot of people don't know, they're like six Harlem teams, all right? So the Globetrotters is the number one showball team, but we all kind of do things differently. Uh, we go out to the community and um, ticket sales and concession, it goes back to the community, it goes back to the organization. So we put on a fun, family-friendly show, and we're giving back at the same time, so it's awesome. The biggest thing is the kids. Um, no matter what we do, there's going to be negativity, we're going to be surrounded by negativity, but when we come into town, we get to hang out with the kids, we see them smile and have fun, and it gets to take people's mind off of negativity for a little while, so that's the biggest thing is to be able to put on a good show for the community. The Harlem Ambassadors faced the Nightmares, who had an impressive roster, which ranged from community leaders, school teachers, and former pros like Lou Richardson. The UCLA All-American and Minnesota Timberwolves first draft pick in franchise history told us how it felt to be back on the hardwood. Truly? <laughs> I'm glad I'm retired. How about that? But it was good. It's for a good cause, so I had fun. I had fun. It was really a great game. It was fun. You know, it, it's it really amazing. You get a chance to see what young is like. Being young is what, really what it's like. And um, it was really fun to play against. Uh, a lot of dunking, a lot of tricks. And I was impressed with the female player they had. It was really good. You know, I, I think talent, talented group. I mean, anytime you can help kids uh, and get the support um, from uh, from abroad, it's great. And, uh, and the fact that the ambassadors recognize uh, the fact of giving back and stuff like that, which is always important to the community. And I think Shadow Hills did a great job in um, hosting this event. And I had fun. I enjoyed myself. And I, of course, had to get in on the action. Amy. You like that? Do that? I did so much. You really did. I really did. You must still be exhausted. <laughs> Pretty impressive though, right? I'll say. Yeah.